Good morning. This is uh, Wednesday, January 18th, and today's devotion is, It is the Lord. This is John 20. Thomas answered and said to him, My Lord and my God. Jesus said unto her, Give me a drink. That's John 4, 7. How many of us are expecting Jesus Christ to quench our thirst when we should be satisfying him? We should be pouring out our lives, investing our total beings, and not drawing on him to satisfy us. Acts 1 says, You shall be witnesses unto me. That means lives of pure, uncompromising, and unrestrained devotion to the Lord Jesus, which will be satisfying to him wherever he may send us. <clears throat> Beware of anything that competes with your loyalty to Jesus Christ. The greatest competitor of true devotion to Jesus is the service that we do for him. The goal of the call of God is his satisfaction, not simply that we should do something for him. We are not sent to do battle for God, but to be used by God in his battles. Are we more devoted to service than we are to Jesus Christ? That's a great question. Sometimes we can be so caught up in doing in accomplishing that that's what we serve. We actually serve the service, as he said, and not Jesus Christ. The challenge I have for us today is, does the Lord find satisfaction in our service to him? Are we more devoted to service than we are to God himself? Let's pray. Father, we thank you today that you do indeed call us to service. But Lord, it's our prayer that we would never be devoted to the service that would be devoted to you and from that you would send us wherever you want to send us into service so lord if we are being challenged today by getting caught up in uh, serving for the sake of serving and we leave you on the sidelines i pray that you would convict us today and let us grow deeper in our relationship with you and lord may we be free in wherever you want to send us to serve we will go we ask this in Christ's name. Amen. God bless and I'll see you tomorrow.